Welcome to Deep River Farm. The rains finally came and gave us some much needed rain. Hopefully, this corn will produce. This is just feed corn here. I can see the ears are kind of small. You see that. This will tell you right here. Ain't much to it. See that ain't much bigger than my hand. The rain really hurt us. Now some of the ears, getting on out and toward the sunny part up, but the ears are not full. They they just ain't that ain't good a quality. And I can feel missing kernels inside there as well. But I tell you what's been having a heyday, and that's the uh, the coons. They've been in here just wearing this corn out. Let's take a look and see what's inside the shuck. That ain't bad looking corn right there, being but it's awful small cob, I'm gonna tell you that. Awful small looking cob. Tell you what, without the rain, it just about killed us. A lot of the ends of the cobs is, as you can see, he's got a lot of, a lot of, uh, now that's a better looking cob right there. That, that is full to the end. I think it's hit and miss, folks. Hit and miss. Well, that rain missing us like it did for so long. It's, uh, we took a beating. We took a real beating. A lot of the kernels just never did form good. We got a lot of corn down too. You can see down through there. A lot of it's been pulled over. Raccoons is a having a heyday in here. But that's just the way it is. Once you get something going, there's a lot of residents take up. You got your pests. You got your uh, animals. Everything's trying to eat. Everything's searching for moisture. And that's the way it is. If you build it or grow it, they will come. You can guarantee that. But I appreciate you joining us today on Deep River Farm. I hope y'all have a blessed day.